One day in a house full of beautiful guns, the leader was having fun playing billiards. He played billiards enthusiastically. <laughs> In the distance, the Swats were carefully running quickly towards the forest. Three swats gathered in one place. Hi, right, you guys. Come here. One swat guy stood up to discuss tactics with the other two guys. They discussed dividing each other into tasks. Is this Rickson? Okay, okay. And you will attack yes. this okay. Rickson. Do you okay. understand? Okay. Okay. He changed into another outfit to blend into the robber's lair. Hi, give it to me. Already? Okay. The two remaining SWATs split up, each going their own direction to do their duty. <laughs> there was a big brother who appeared in front of the gate, the leader. He entered the gate and saw two robbers guarding the door. Aye. Two robbers stopped Aye. the big brother from entering. The going? robber immediately asked the big brother where he was going and what yeah. he was doing. The big brother quickly Come pointed to, to the backpack Aye. he was wearing on his shoulder. A robber immediately went Boss, in to tell the leader about it. the big brother. The leader looked outside and asked his juniors to let the big guy inside. Yes, sir. All right. Let's go. Come here. The leader invited the big guy to sit and talk about the guns. What do you want? Today I came here. Buy guns. Okay? How do you feel? <laughs> I have a lot of guns. Do you have money? <laughs> yeah. He opened his backpack and took out stacks of money. Do you understand? Look. <laughs> Alright, check it out. Come on. How do you feel? The SWAT guy put on repair clothes and entered the leader's house. He looked through the crack in the door and saw two robbers guarding it. He went into the house. Two robbers immediately stopped and questioned him. Where are you going? I came to fix the electricity. Hi, <laughs> you lead it inside. A robber led him in and pointed to the direction that needed repairs. Hi. Uh. Hi, this way. Uh, okay. Check it out. The leader and the boss didn't care and just told each other that someone was going to fix it. Iswat went to the repair station. Come on. All right, do it quickly. Hurry up. Uh, 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 hurry up. Oh, okay. Come on. Hurry up. Hurry up. The leader led the boss out to see the guns and introduced them. The robber went out and kept watch.
<laughs> oh, this is kind of friendly. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Be okay. careful, all right? Uh, let me check. Uh. <laughs> SWAT took advantage of them not paying attention and placed a bomb in the corner of the wall. He moved the location to another place and placed another hidden bomb in the corner of the cabinet. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Okay. He gently placed the gun in his bag. The two leaders and the boss were engrossed in their discussion when the SWAT guy gently stood up, put the gun in his pocket and aimed at the leader. The leader turned to see the gun and quickly dodged it. The big brother was also destroyed by S the big brother quickly ran away. The assistant saw that and immediately shot at Mr. SWAT also shot back at the, the two robbers heard the gunshots and quickly ran in and shot at Mr. SWAT. Mr. SWAT saw that the situation was not good and jumped out the window to escape. Huh? Okay. The leader and his accomplices angrily chased SWAT. He quickly ran to a corner of the wall, then turned on the remote control and pressed the bomb button. The bomb in the house exploded, killing the two robbers who were running out instantly. The leader and his assistant heard the sound of the bomb exploding and immediately turned around and saw their comrade. He quickly ran away. The angry leader grabbed the assistant's gun and chased after the SWAT. The SWAT ran into a forest. The leader immediately chased after him. The two sides chased each other. The SWAT turned around and fired several shots at the leader and his assistant. The leader also ran out and shot at SWAT. The SWAT immediately signaled his teammates to aim at the leader and shoot him. leader looked into the distance and saw someone, so he fired several shots in that direction. Huh? He ordered his assistant to destroy them. The two sides are still fighting fiercely with each other. After his gun ran out of bullets, he quickly called his teammates up to shoot the leader while he went down to get another gun. The other SWAT immediately ran up and fired several shots at the leader. The assistant ran around to another street. The two SWAT men started moving towards the leader and shot him. A SWAT guy who was shooting, not paying attention to what was behind him, was stabbed to death by his assistant with a knife. She picked up the gun and shot it at Mrs. Watt, who was seriously injured. The remaining SWAT saw this and shot continuously at the assistant. The leader quickly shot again at the injured SWAT and killed him. The remaining SWAT quickly ran away. The leader called his assistant to quickly chase him. The SWAT jumped over the wall and ran quickly forward. He hid in a pile of straw right there. Chasing. He saw two people chasing after him, quickly disassembled the gun and shot continuously at the leader. The assistant also quickly took out her gun and shot it at him. The SWAT rolled over and shot directly at the assistant, causing her to die on the spot. No. The angry leader grabbed the gun, but the SWAT quickly shot it at him. He rolled to the side to avoid the bullets. His gun ran out of bullets, so he quickly ran out to attack the leader. 
The two fought back and forth. He kicked the leader into the tree and quickly picked up the gun from the ground and fired several shots at the leader. He died on the spot. Swat knelt down, looked in the distance at his dead comrades, and screamed loudly throughout the forest. Ah!